Hey, what is going on? This is Rob from Panther. Today, we're going to check it out this isometric uh, shape illustrator. So this is super simple. The first step you should do is swap it from fill to stroke. So now I'm the stroke. Uh, I'm going to select the black color. I'm going to long click on the rectangle and select the polygon tool. Press and hold shift plus alt, create a hexagon. Press and hold shift or rotate it 90 degrees. And now I'm going to select the pen tool. I'm going to create a line from top to bottom until they intersect. I'm going to select the line and then go to the rotate tool and select the rotate tool. And double click on the rotate tool and type in 60 degrees. Click on copy, press control D. Select all right click group. I'm going to press and hold shift, scale it down a little. And from here, I'm going to press and hold alt and create a new copy. And I'm going to drag it here until they intersect. I'm going to press and hold Alt again, drag it to the left, also press Shift to isolate until they intersect on the left. There you go. So now we have the construction of the shape. I'm going to select all right click group. And now I'm going to swap it from stroke to fill. I'm going to click on the fill and select the color. I'm going to go with some blue. And I'm going to go to the layers, lock this layer, create a new one and select the pen tool. With the pen tool, I'm going to start drawing one of the side of the shape. I'm actually going to swap it from field to stroke so I can see exactly what I'm doing. I'm going to swap it back. Basically here with these little arrows, you can swap it or press Shift plus X. I'm going to select the rotate tool again. I'm going to press and hold Alt and click here in the center, in the center point. And instead of 60 degrees, I'm going to double it and basically type in 120 degrees. Click on copy, press control D. And there we have three sides. I'm going to make this really light. From here, you can select all right click group, go to the object pattern, make. From here, I'm going to need to select brick by column. There you go. And I'm going to decrease the height first. I mean the white, the width until these two starts to connect. There you go. And 113, I mean, at 213, they connected. I'm going to decrease the height. Okay, 246, perfect. I'm going to click on done, delete this. I'm going to select the rectangle. Actually, you know what? I'm going to create it in the hexagon. Really interesting. I'm going to create a hexagon, press and hold shift to rotate it. And I can select the pattern. Okay, the pattern is too big. Now I'm going to go to the object, transform, scale. I'm going to uncheck these and decrease the uniform. And click OK. This is how we make this isometric form in Illustrator. Thanks for watching. And if you're new on the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates. And also check out the rest of the videos at the end. Have a good one. Bye bye.